You know, excitement and joy are normally the emotions associated with childbirth, but 10% of new moms experience fear and anxiety after the birth of a child. But six is on call for you this afternoon. Joining us to talk about the baby blues and postpartum depression is Oxner OBGYN Dr. Veronica Gillespie. And Dr. Gillespie, it's good to see you. Thank you for joining us today. Uh, you know, many people call it postpartum. Some people call it baby blues. Uh, what are the signs of this and what is it? Well, um, postpartum depression is just like major depression. There's feelings of guilt, there's feelings of sadness, there's lack of interest in normally pleasurable activities, lack of interest in the baby, insomnia, all those things that we associate with, with normal major depression is also associated with postpartum depression. The only difference is that those feelings are in the uh, period after having a baby. Well, let's talk about when this is most common in terms of uh, a woman's pregnancy. Um, as far as postpartum depression, it can develop anywhere between two weeks after the delivery all the way up to one year in the postpartum period. The most common time for it develop, to develop is actually six weeks after delivery. You know, I would imagine that what actually kind of augments the problem even more is the fact that these ladies may be feeling this for the first time and that frustrates them even more. Uh, what kinds of treatment, if any, are used for new moms with this type of depression? Well, there's lots of treatments available. Uh, the first actually is to get a, an actual diagnosis of postpartum depression. You're right, lots of women feel very guilty about these feelings and so they don't come forth to their phys physicians. So we as physicians need to do better about questioning the patients to see if they're having these symptoms when they come for their postpartum visit. And as far as treatment, we can offer them antidepressants as well as psychotherapy. And those have all found to be uh, very, very effective. I guess there, there probably seems to be, I would think, a fine line between uh, feeling a little bit out of sorts with such a major change in your life and having postpartum, how can you tell the difference? Well, there are three psychoaffective disorders that we see in the postpartum period. That's postpartum blues, postpartum depression, and postpartum psychosis. With the postpartum blues, there is this feeling of sadness, um, just as you, as you mentioned, just the emotional changes that go along with having a newborn. Those symptoms show up about two to three days after delivery, but the big importance and the big difference in that in postpartum depression is that the symptoms resolve on their own in about two weeks. Whereas with postpartum depression, the symptoms will linger on. All right, doesn't hurt to see the doctor if you feel like you may have it. Dr. Veronica Absolutely. Gillespie, OBGYN over at Oxner. Thanks for joining us. Thank you.